Hey, welcome everybody to fishingwithvance.com and our Gulp Alive video that you're about to watch. We wanted to give you a little bit about what we're using and how we're using it as far as hook setup and things like that. So, as you can see here in our container, we're using the Gulp Alive minnows. Our preferred color that we're using is a black shad. Um, we have used other colors or uh, configurations such as the rainbow, the smelt, the watermelon pearl, but we've had the best luck with our black shad. These guys here in this, uh, this is actually a hodgepodge of everything that we have left. So we have everything in there from two and a half inches up to four inches. As far as how we rig it, I use this bigger one here so that you guys could see. This is actually a four inch one. Uh, we have our Gamagatsu hook in here. That's a three aught, which is one of these guys right here. And we rigged it like this with that offset hook. Uh, you can actually rig it one of two ways. You can rig it like this with the uh, the bent part here at the bottom that is going to make that fall like that because the weight is down here or you can rig it the other way and put it up here which is then typically then going to turn this upside down and put the white top of the minnow on the top some guys like that some guys don't um, then up the line we uh, will definitely make sure that we have a swivel uh, because you have to have that in the river because this thing is going to constantly turn as you're bringing it back through the current. And then uh, either one split shot or two depending on the current conditions. So uh, we just want to give you a quick uh, update on what we were using there. Hope that you guys enjoy the video here coming forward. Please make sure that you subscribe. And uh, as always, fish right, here on. we are in Sharpsville. This is a quick after work blast with my boy Cat over there. I don't even know what date it is. I think it's like... July the, July the 14th, 2016. Catter's got a purple worm in the, in the water already. I don't know if we'll get him or not, but I know we're going to have fun. We're going to try out some new baits tonight. Maybe a little gulp alive. Uh, see if they're hitting tubes. I know one thing we'll be hitting. That's Getco afterwards for <laughs> Getco uh, <clears throat> General So Sandwich that is now live so i'm sure catter will enjoy that fishing with vance dot com vance may be on the board here he's trying out the gulp alive just to see what's what catter just had one on he's a little guy threw it off the hook but i'll uh, take Vance it. with another big big smallie he showed himself he smashed it this it's on the gulp alive again but it's a nice fish take my time with him show this video to my brother-in-law Mike it was his idea aka high life it was his idea to get these golf alive <laughs> and uh, so I thought I'd test market them for him tonight because he's gonna be fishing for a week and look at this dude this is a beauty oh, yeah. this is <laughs> he ain't giving up easy but there we go <laughs> alive maybe on to something this was a this was a smash on the gulp alive. This, wow, that was an aggressive hit right there. I like it. Floating that minnow down the middle. The gulp alive. He said smash, and he he just had this gulp alive thrown off too. You gotta love it. I'm going through gulp alive like it's my job. <laughs> He's, they're behind the currents. These boys are sitting behind the current. Thanks. Okay, folks, what we might have here is our first for me on the Gulp Alive. Holy shit, it's a striper. Pretty sure that's a striper. scared to throw it in the water. I don't know what the hell I'm going to pull out. Get over here. This, <coughs> this guy here smoked it. Just little shit though.
Jeez. Oh, is that thing fat? Damn it, that thing weighs a ton for a fish that size. Pig on, pig on. Can't tell he's I'm almost got him. I think it might might be a carp, I can't tell. Shit, it's a carp. Nah, it's a carp. I've hooked him in his back lower fin. Right in the middle. Call up alive. That's one. This is a good one. Yes, sir. Right in the middle again, buddy. Ants has a good one on here. He was right in the middle. Oh, yeah, that's a nice one. Trying out my new single one piece rod. This dude. Oh yeah. Gulp alive, right in the middle, baby. Yeah, you. I <laughs> pass this water up. They're hitting every cast in here. This is fish number five for Vance. The gulp alive is alive. There's another one. Another one right in the dead middle. Smoking the gulp a lot behind the rocks again. Behind those rocks, man, that's where they're living. Vance is on fire in the middle here. Just like this guy, right in the middle. This is fish number eight. Oh, yeah. God, he gave me the good water, baby. Right, right in those rocks, right behind those rocks, right where they are. Right behind the rocks. There's no secret. I didn't, I missed that spot because they were Right. That's why I didn't want to miss it. And there he is. Just had the pattern, that's all. Not Nothing special. I just had the pattern. Sometimes you guess right. Got her behind the ripples. He has a nice one on too. It looks like a beauty. Check it out, folks. He's doing the advanced fighting technique. Keep him down. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> Fishing with Vance.com, baby. I'm down here. I just caught another one, so I am at four, but he's just on a roll here. Oh, it's a nice. 
No way, baby. It's a pretty fish. Oh, yeah. Fishing with ass are calm tonight in Sharpsville. Nice one. That's with fifth no, fish number 15, I believe. 14 smallies and one cat. And that's number, number 15. We on them, kids. This is fish number 16. Again, behind the ripples, in the middle. Oh. You gotta love it. Hey guys, thanks for checking out our video on fishingwithvance.com on the Gulf of Life. You can see, here's a little bit of a recap of what we were using that day. We had the various different Gulf of Life uh, products here. We had the watermelon pearl. We had the smelt. We had the rainbow. Our most popular one, as I said in the beginning, was the black shad. Uh, had a lot of luck with that and a couple of the different hook sets that we had. So, with that being said, you know what we do when we do for the day ending ceremonies here at fishingwithvance.com fish on welcome to miller town god forgives and i don't